What's going on guys and welcome back to No Deflection Gaming. Today we're looking at trash people and their views they put up when they don't even come near endgame for an MMORPG. And yes, we are looking at Bless Unleashed, the new released uh, MMO for PC. So let's just look at this review, dive in, take some notes, and then discuss it afterwards. I'm going to admit right up front, the title was very much satire. I was not being serious at all. But what I did want to talk about is the fact that I get called out repeatedly pretty much everywhere online because of my views on Bless Unleashed and Bless Online. In specific, I actually got called out just earlier today on Reddit. They went ahead and made a Reddit thread titled Why MMO Byte Hate Bless Unleashed. And this is not the first time this has happened. This has happened plenty of times over the course of the last year. There was actually someone who made a thread over on Steam saying that I am in essence going to kill the game. Yeah, like my opinion on this one specific game is going to be solely responsible for the downfall of the entire title, the entire IP. No, that is just stupid. The reason I hate Bless Unleashed the reason I genuinely want this game to fail is because A, the company behind the game at one point reached out to me and offered me thousands of dollars to uh, try and trick you guys, to lie to you, to get you to go ahead and purchase Bless Online, Bless Unleashed. The fact that the game has scammed hundreds of thousands of players out of tens of millions of dollars and the fact that the game just ultimately looks like a really cheap mobile game. And you know what? I'm gonna go ahead here Take a few minutes of your guys' time if you're interested and discuss all three of those points. So MMO Bite is obviously just taking a jab at Round 8 Studios and the guys that developed Bless Unleashed basically because he's pissed off that the alpha for Bless Online, not Bless Unleashed, but Bless Online, got fucked by everybody. Basically, the alpha was releasing for a certain amount of money. I think it was 150 to 200 bucks. And then uh, about a month or two later, they released the game for free. So it is what it is, shit happens, get the fuck over it. Now let's take a look at his second review, uh, like two weeks later, after Bless Unleashed is finally doing really well on PC. Well, honestly, are any of you even surprised that that was how Bless Unleashed was received day one? Because I'm gonna be honest with you, I am not. But at the same time, I know that a lot of those negative reviews were left by people that are either upset with Bless Online or upset with Neoways as a company. And if there is one thing that I am against, especially when it comes to reviews and trusting reviews, it is review bombing. I hate when people mass either positively review or negatively review a game, especially when they haven't played it. And that is what was done here. And that is evidenced by the fact that after just three days, as you guys can tell, the reviews have gone up from mostly negative to mixed. There are thus far out of 9,000 reviews, 50% of them are positive. And yeah, you guys are gonna have to ignore that really derpy looking face down there. Now, the reason I wanted to talk about this today was not because I wanted to tell you guys you shouldn't be playing Bless Unleashed on PC. I've done multiple videos over the course of the last year that addressed both Bless Unleashed, NeoWiz, and Round 8 Studio as developers and publishers. But at the end of the day, this game is completely free to play. And despite the fact that I still think that this game kind of looks like a, a mobile game, I do urge you guys to, if you are at all interested, go ahead and download and try it out. Okay, so in his original video, he's saying, screw Best Unleashed, don't even play it, don't even look at it, it's a crappy mobile looking game, you know, I hope the game fails, XYZ, it is what it is. Now, if you look at a second review, and you see he's basically saying, yeah, you know what, um, yeah, I still hate the game, but, you know, you should go check it out, because, you know, it's a free MMO, blah blah blah. Now, either one or two things happened. Either A, Round 8, or someone from Bless Unleashed Studios in some way, shape, or form came out and paid this guy a shit ton of money to make him say this, because I can't believe that I'm seeing MMO Byte say that. Um, or he's probably seeing that the game's actually doing well, and why would you want to be on the bad side of a game that's doing well? I bet you a lot of the people that follow him are saying, hey, I played the game, even though you said it was trash, and it turns out it's actually better than half the stuff that you play. So, I think this is where we are right now. And I'm not just picking on MMO Byte here. There's also, you know, Force Gaming's the same shit, Asgardia Gaming, same shit. 
basically saying the game sucks ass, and none of them, I guarantee you, none of them even played to Endgame. So, with that being said, thanks guys for watching, I know this is a rant and a half. If you like the videos, stay tuned, I got some more dungeon videos coming out for Bless Unleashed. Um, so hit that like button, smash that notification button, subscribe, do all the things, and once again, appreciate you all. Peace out.